when you hug him. <laughs> you got it. It's Pip. Okay. Fly spy with my penguin eye. A giant spaceship? There it is. Okay, my turn. Wait a minute. A giant spaceship? Come on, let's check it out. <gasps> wow. Now, but here comes a space bird. And he looks just like... <gasps> Mr. Woodbird. Fellas, it is me. Behold, my latest invention, the Spaceshipinator Moon Thousand. You built a spaceship, Mr. Woodbird? Oh, yes. It's been my dream ever since I was a wee little woodpecker to one day visit the moon and make incredible discoveries. Wow, your spaceship Anita looks flamazing. Snowdily. It's even cooler on the inside. Come check it out. I've been working on this beauty forever. It's got all the latest buttons, doodads, and galactic gizmos. Look, Pip, it even has a smoothie bar. Actually, those smoothies aren't for drinking. They power the spaceship Anita. Apparently, smoothies make excellent rocket fuel. Does this thing actually fly? Does it fly, he asks. <laughs> Does it fly? No idea, actually. I haven't tested it out yet. <gasps> Aw, looks like Dusty Wusty wants to visit the moon, too. Just be careful you don't touch any buttons. <gasps> it's happening. It's happening. What's happening? We're blasting off. <laughs> <laughs> Boys, we're about to boldly go where no bird or baby has gone before. To the moon! To Fun! Not fun. We have to deliver Dusty to her family in the Camelot Desert. There isn't time to go all the way to the moon. We gotta go back. No moon? Come on, Pip. I'm sure it's not that far away. Actually... It is. But we can set our rocket thrusters to hyper diaper speed. That'll get us there and back before Dusty's delivery. Wow. What do you say, Pip? Please? I say, let's go to the moon. Yippee! <laughs> All right, Astro Tots, fashion your feathers. Now activating hyper. <laughs> Whoopsie. Uh, let's try that again. Spaceship go! In a rocket through the sky we go, bringing you to the moon. It's a true delight, we're on a lunar flight, bringing you to the moon. Oh, 
I can't believe it. We made it to the moon. Wow. <gasps> Ready to see the moon, Dusty Westy? Mm-hmm. Oh, you three go ahead. I gotta get my camera. I want photos of all of our amazing moon discoveries. Wow! Mm. Oh, it looks so deserty. Wow! The moon has palm trees? Wow! The moon has camels? Wow! The moon even has cutie patootie babies? Hello! Greetings, moon babies. We're from Earth. And we come with cheese. Wait, wait! What? Sorry, little guys. This spaceship's not for playing on. By the way, could you tell us where we are? Desert! <gasps> Freddy, <laughs> this place looks so deserty because it is the desert. We didn't actually make it to the moon. We actually made it to the moon! This is the greatest day of my life! Poor Mr. Woodbird. He's gonna be so disappointed. Guess we better go tell him. Wait! Mr. Woodbird looks so happy. Maybe we can let him think we're on the moon for just a little while longer? He does look super happy. But when he sees the moon in the sky, he's gonna know we're not on it. The moon has its very own moon! Wow! Or maybe he won't know. Come on, Astro Tots! We've got a moon to explore! Ooh! Wow! Uh-oh! Uh, Mr. Woodbird, look over there! What? <gasps> a moon rock? Incredible! Mm. <gasps> Mr. Woodbird, look over here! A moon tree? Magnificent! <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mr. Woodbird, look this way. Oh! Did Pip say this way? I think he meant the other this way. Freddy, look behind you. What is it? I don't see anything. Is that what I think it is? Yes, it's a sandcastle. Made of moon dust! Uh, yeah, yes! That's exactly what it is. Moon amazing! Wow, I've made so many incredible discoveries. We did it. Look how happy Mr. Woodbird is. Yep, and he had no idea we were in the desert this whole time. Well, Mr. Woodbird, it's time to bring Dusty to our parents. Ready to head back to the spaceship? Sure am. After we get one last photo, I want to remember this special day forever. Everyone say, best moon trip ever. Best moon trip ever. Time to power up the engines and blast us back to Earth. Huh, that's strange. It says we're out of fuel. Ah, putting a smoothie bar on the spaceship, Anator, was a great idea. Freddy, those smoothies were for rocketing, not drinking. Ah, I totally forgot. Exploring the desert, I mean, moon, made me really thirsty. Is there any other way to start the engines? Uh, according to my calculations, there is not. We could be stuck on the moon forever. Huh? And that means we're not going to make it back to Tots. Or Dusty's home. Aww. Dusty's family lives right here in the desert. But if we tell Mr. Woodbird, he'll know we never made it to the moon. He'll be so sad. Maybe we don't have to tell him. This time, this flamingo's got a plan. Uh, ooh, uh... <laughs> What's going on? It, um, sounds like we're blasting off. How is that possible? Must have had some fuel left over after pew, all. Pew, pew. Yep. No. Guess we'll be in the desert any minute now. <gasps> space, space, space! That's funny. The rocket thrusters sound a lot like Freddy. Really? Sounds like regular old rocket thrusters to me. <laughs> <gasps> it is Freddy! Hi, Mr. Whippard. Okay, you two. What's going on? Mr. Woodbird, there's something we have to tell you. We're not really on the moon. We're not? We landed in the Camelot Desert by mistake. 
Freddie and I didn't want to tell you because we knew it was your dream to visit the moon. We're sorry. We know you're upset. Boy, that's the happiest upset face I've ever seen. I'm not upset. You boys were just trying to make my dream of visiting the moon come true. And that's one of the nicest things anyone's ever done for me. But you didn't make any moon discoveries. Nope. But look at all these amazing discoveries we made right here on Earth. I never knew the desert was this magnificent. Dusty lives in a pretty incredible place. She sure does. Speaking of which, we still have one final mission. To boldly go where Dusty has never been before. Into the loving arms of her parents. <laughs> I took a lot of photos today, but this is by far my favorite one. Now we just have to figure out what to do with the spaceship. <laughs> <laughs> I think I might have an idea for that. 